Ninth annual Superhero Challenge is this weekend in Tulsa. It's raising awareness and funds for the Child Abuse Network. Two News anchor Justin Fisher will MC the event Sunday. Here he is with a preview of the festivities and more on Can's mission. What did you like about last year? Bubbles. Bubbles? Were they big bubbles? A superhero of few words. That's four-year-old Margot, and she is no stranger to the superhero challenge. Her family has been participating for the past several years, including her mom, Rachel. It's a really fun family atmosphere. All that fun is happening at the Post Oak Lodge and Retreat in Tulsa on Sunday. There will be professionally designed obstacle courses, food trucks, music, and so much more at the Superhero Village. So from the bouncy houses to the STEM activities, we had a great time and it was really hard to get my kids to leave. And while Sunday is about fun and being together, there is a very serious message behind the event. It's a way to raise awareness and funds for the Child Abuse Network, or CAN. The Child Abuse Network oversees a multidisciplinary team that helps investigate child abuse cases at no cost to families in a child-friendly focused environment. Lisa Johansson, CAN Superhero Challenge event organizer, says there are a lot of kids who need that help. So over 1,700 children, I believe the actual number is 1,769 children, were served last year. There were over 14,000 child abuse and neglect cases in the state of Oklahoma last year alone. Over 2,500 of those were in Tulsa County. And all that work requires funding and awareness. We kind of look at the Superhero Challenge as our friend raising and awareness raising events. And through that awareness, Johansson says it's important for the community to know what CAN's mission actually is and how it helps the community. And then of course, you know, we raise sponsorships and you know raise some dollars to help actually fund that mission. But at the end of the day, this is a lot of people's introduction to the Child Abuse Network. And after the pandemic disrupting it the last couple of years, she says the Superhero Challenge will be one to remember. So I feel like this year is really the first year that we are back in full swing. Um, so we're really excited about it. In Tulsa, Justin Fisher, 2 News, Oklahoma.